ground launch sequencer will verify that the three main engines are ready to start. The SRB joint heaters are being deactivated at this time and power is being removed from ground support equipment. T minus 40 seconds. Transferring to orbiter internal power. Coming up on the go for auto sequence start. Selection, sir, for auto sequence start. And we have a go for auto sequence start. Discovery's onboard computers have primary control of all the vehicle's critical functions. T minus 20 seconds. T minus 16 seconds. Sound suppression water system has been activated, protecting Discovery and the launch pad from acoustical energy. We have a go for main engine start. T minus 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Booster ignition and liftoff of Discovery, hoisting harmony to the heavens and opening new gateways for international science. Discovery has cleared the tower. Houston now controlling. Program. Roger roll, Discovery. Discovery's roll maneuver is complete. It's now in a head down position on track for its flight to the International Space Station. Discovery seven miles downrange and altitude two statute miles. Flying at 600 miles per hour. Discovery's engines are throttling down as the orbiter passes through the area of maximum pressure on the vehicle. Now 50 seconds into the flight. Discovery eight miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center and altitude six statute miles. Flying at 900 miles per hour. Discovery Houston, go with throttle up. Copy, go with throttle up. The three engines on board are throttling back up. At lift off, the fully fueled shuttle boosters and external tank weighed four and a half million pounds. The total thrust at launch was six million four hundred and twenty five thousand pounds. Discovery now thirteen miles downrange at an altitude of thirteen statute miles, flying at one thousand seven hundred miles per hour. All systems continue to function well. Three good main engines, three good power generating fuel cells, and three good auxiliary power units for the hydraulic system. Discovery now 24 miles downrange at an altitude 23 statute miles, flying at 2,700 miles per hour. One minute 58 seconds into the flight, standing by for burnout and separation of the solid rocket boosters. Combined, the twin boosters provide 5.3 million pounds of thrust to propel the orbiter towards space. Booster officer here in mission control confirming the booster separation. Two minutes, 25 seconds. Italia 1. Propulsion officer here 